hey guys welcome back to my channel so i'm going to be doing a voiceover throughout this video just explaining what i'm doing but today i'm going to be showing you guys how i made like little snacks slash treats for my friends so basically in this video i made puff puff mini pancakes and then i was trying out a new recipe so let's see how that turned out i guess so let's introduce our ingredients we have flour milk baking powder salt sugar and then butter ignore the date on the counter i promise that's not how they're how they see is that's just how we made the room but yeah so we had eggs i used three eggs just because i didn't want to make it too much and then it will all go to waste but basically the first thing i did was to break my eggs in a plate and then just leave those ones aside while we get into the main mixture So next and separately i added my milk baking powder yeast sugar salt and then i got another bowl and then i added flour and i just basically mixed all the dry ingredients together in a bowl Then with our flour, I'm just going to pour in our liquid mixture because I just added water to that mixture. Then we're going to add our eggs. I didn't add all the eggs because I also wanted to use it for the second recipe. And then we're just going to mix that so we have a very nice, not too thick but not too watery consistency. And this is going to be for our pancakes. So for our second recipe i just grabbed another bowl then we're going to add our flour sugar baking powder a little bit of salt yeast and this is going to be for our puff puff So now we're going to mix very well. I added too much milk and it started looking like pop gone wrong. So we added more flour just to give it a more thicker consistency but not too thick so that it will not be like very tough in the mouth I guess. Then I broke up some chocolate so I can melt them later. Okay, so before you guys get confused, what the heck is this? This is the new recipe I was talking about. I didn't record me doing it because I was like doing it on like real fire. So it's literally just a mixture of melted butter, flour, um, salt, and I let that heat in the pot and I was stirring it while it was on the fire because it's supposed to be hot. So that's why I didn't do it. But this is how the dough looks like once you remove it from the fire. And you're supposed to mix it while it's still warm so it will like really form.
so basically we'll just mix the egg into the mixture and it will give us a very nice even though scattered dough but it still like turned out nice then i put this dough in a piping bag and you can literally like make any shape you want because it's like very flexible so you can make it straight twisty turny any design you want it will come out how you want it to be So once I finished frying everything, I decided to plate it in a little container kind of vibe and it came out so pretty. No, I love me a motherfucking tree. Yeah. Got a white boy on my roster, he be feeding me pasta and lobster. He just hit me up on Tuesday like, what you doing, babe? Let me take you shopping. I told him, well, I'm a little busy. He said, damn, I'm in your city. But anyway, it's okay. Hope you have a good day. I'ma see you by day 50. Then I told him, you treat me so well. He said, cash out, Pazelle. Matter of fact, scratch that. I'ma see you with stat just cause you fine as hell. And I told him, well, thank you, baby. Anything for my favorite lady. Well, I gotta go. They just let me know that I could pick up my Mercedes. I got hoes. Might just be your nigga. In different area codes. He know what's up. I was actually happy that everything turned out the way I wanted it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're new. And bye.